MailChimp landing page tutorial. Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to be showing you how you can build your landing page using MailChimp. So let's get into it. Now, the first thing you need to do is sign up for MailChimp. It's pretty simple. You're just going to go on to MailChimp.com over here, and then you're going to click on sign up, and then you're going to fill out the sign up form with your email and your first and last name. Now, after you have signed up for MailChimp, you're going to see this basic navigation board or your basic homepage or dashboard. Now, on your dashboard you're going to see on your left you have your basic navigation panel where you can see you have your create section you have your audience you have your campaigns automation website content studio integrations and search section so what you're going to do is you're just going to click on website over here and you can see i already have a website but i'm going to delete this website and i'm going to start from scratch and show you guys how you can actually create your own new website so i'm just going to go back into my website settings I'm going to scroll down, I'm going to click on my site status and I can delete my site and this is another great thing about MailChimp is that you can change your website or your landing page. So let's say if you were promoting a product for three months, after three months, you can easily delete that landing page or just edit the landing page to promote a different or new product. So what you're going to do is once you have your basic website section over here, you can start designing your site or selling products or offering services. The section that you're going to choose is designing your site because it's the most similar to a landing page. Now, you're just going to click on set up your site over here and you're going to choose a name for your site so for my landing page let's say i just want this to be a welcome landing page so i'm just going to use this um or maybe i want this to be jane's journey and i want this to be my welcome page for jane's journey i'm going to click on edit my site over here now once you have done that you're just going to click on edit page over here and if this is a singular landing page you can keep it as one but if you want to add more pages you can click on add page over here and start adding more pages now you can see that there are different styles that you can choose from different colors different themes that you can choose so if i go on to the theme section i can change this and this will be applied to my entire website and if I go on to the color section and change the colors over here, this will be applied to my entire website. And this is one way to really keep your entire website cohesive at the same time because this really enables you to keep a general brand aesthetic without having to customize and change everything individually. So I'm just going to change this up and I'm going to use these kinds of fonts. Now, after that, I'm actually going to go into the pages section. I'm going to go on to my home page or the singular page that I have and start editing my page. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to drag up the section section uh, over here and I'm going to delete these excess sections that I don't need. So I'm just going to delete all of this stuff from here. I don't need any excess text. So I just want a header intro or I don't even need an intro section. I need a header text and just header then text and image and then my footer because i want to keep this landing page as simple as possible now once i have done that i can just click on any of these sections to start editing i can change the fonts as well and if you want something to be out of the theme you can choose to do that i'm going to keep it as it is and you have different logo options as well so if you have a image logo you can add that as over here if you do but i don't have one so i'm just going to keep it as the basic image logo that i do um, as the basic text logo that i am using so i'm I'm just going to do that over here like this now i'm going to click on this header and what i'm going to do is i'm going to disable my navigation and i'm going to click on layout over here and i'm going to change this layout to be over here so i want this to be centered and after that i'm going to click on this section i'm going to change the layout and i want the image to be on the left now after i have done that i'm going to use the color scheme and i want to change up the color scheme for this section i want this to be white with black text now i'm going to replace the image and i'm just going to replace this with some stock footage obviously you can just go on to the content studio and upload your own images as well but i'm just going to use a stock photo for reference so i'm just going to scroll down over here and i'm just going to search for girl because this is like a welcome page for jane's journey so what i'm going to do is i'm going to add this photo i'm going to click on use image and i'm just going to add some text so i'm going to remove this text and i'm, I'm just going to remove this over here welcome to my life's journey like so and you can link a blog or anything like that over here as well 
And after that, this is going to be the footer. You can add some information if you want. I'm just going to delete these sections because I don't really need them like this. And now I have a very simple and easy landing page that I have created using MailChimp. Now, I'm just going to click on done over here. I'm going to click on publish. And now my landing page is live. If I click on over here, it's going to open up my landing page. You can see that the domain name that you get with these sites uh, are usually very ugly, but with MailChimp, the domain name that you get is pretty decent. You have uh, .mailchimpsites.com. That's a pretty simple kind of transaction considering you're getting free hosting, free domain names, and you get a free website as well. Now, once you have your site live, you can start editing it from here as well. And on your MailChimp dashboard, you also get traffic highlights you have view all report section where you can get detailed analytics of your website and you can start selling products and offering different services on your website or on your landing page as well but it gives you a pretty simple way to edit your site as well so you can change the site title later on you can change the domain name you can have a pop-up form if you want but i have those disabled you can enable site tracking as well to see what kind of audience you are getting and you can track with facebook pixel you can track with Google Analytics, you can use Google Restrictive Data Processing, and to use this tracking, I, you have to agree to MailChimp's additional terms, and you're just gonna click on save over here, and you can get tracking on your website as well. Now, currently, after that, you have your site status, and I have published my site, but if you want to take your site down for a while, you can up unpublish it as well, and then later on republish it if it's under maintenance or if you're doing some editing on your website, and you can choose to delete it after your mission for your website or landing page has been accomplished. So with MailChimp, you're able to do all of this for free. If you go on the pricing section over here, you can see that the free version of MailChimp includes MailChimp domains, website builders, creative assistance, and marketing CRMs, and forms and landing pages. So you can get all of the features that you need to develop your own landing page for free using MailChimp. And then you have the essentials version where you can get a lot more with custom branding and um, email marketing uh, tools, but those are mostly email marketing tools if you're only looking for a landing page i would definitely suggest that you use the free version of mailchimp so that was it for today i hope you guys found this video helpful and you are now able to create your own landing page using mailchimp we are about to end this video and to end it on a good note i would like to request you guys that if you found this video helpful or if you found this method exactly what you wanted or what you were looking for consider subscribing to our youtube channel and sharing it with your friends and family who might learn a thing or two from this video or learn a thing or two from the hundreds of videos that we have on our channel and of course if you have any questions any queries about anything in this video or with related to our entire channel or any of our videos make sure to leave a comment down below and ask us what you want from our videos i tried to cover everything i could in this video but if you want to see more details of the methods or the ways in this video just let me know in the comments down below and i'll be sure to make more videos on your suggestions at the end of the day it's all about providing you guys with valuable content that could help and still a positive change in your life and hopefully your friend and family's life as well and at the end i would like to request you to make sure to hit that like button and subscribe to our youtube channel as it helps out our videos a lot and again thank you so much for watching till next time goodbye